where three people were stabbed on a quiet street in Mayfield Heights. Right now, all three victims are recovering in the hospital. The suspect was later arrested in Solon. Deborah Lee is live on five where it all began. Mayfield Heights police are telling me that Matthew Seepig broke into his ex-girlfriend's apartment on Golden Gate Boulevard, allegedly stabbed her, her mother, and a family friend. He fled but was apprehended in Solon. Police say he darted into traffic and he was hit by a truck. Now, neighbors on Golden Gate are stunned today. They never expected this to happen so close to home. Live on 5 in Mayfield Heights, I'm Deborah Lee. The suspect in the attack is a military veteran. On your side, investigator Sarah Buddison is live on 5. She joins us in Mayfield Heights with details on his background. Mayfield Heights police have been keeping an eye on Matthew Sepik's apartment here behind me. A few, few of these buildings behind me all day while they wait for a judge to sign off on a search warrant. As you were saying, we did some digging and found that Sepik is a 28-year-old Iraq War veteran who served several tours as a military police officer. He currently works as a security officer at Hillcrest Hospital, which is just around the corner from where I'm at now. A former classmate we tracked down today told us that CPIC graduated from CSU last year and had applied to be a U.S. Marshal. That same classmate also told us that during a recent conversation with CPIC, CPIC expressed that he was very sad about his breakup with his girlfriend. Live on 5 in Mayfield Heights, I'm investigator Sarah Buddison.